It's going to be another warm day, a head bath, and also fairly dry. You're mentioning some chances for rain, but we need it. We do. Yeah, we still have those abnormally dry conditions, despite the fact that it was a very wet September. We had over five inches of rain for the month of September. That's two inches above where we should be. One of those days featured two inches of rain alone. So it was a very wet month. We also had temperatures close to 90. The warmest was 89 and our coolest was 46. That was set back on September 26th. As we head through October, things should start to cool down. Our normals will start to cool down as we go through the rest of the month. Right now it's cool outside. We've got mostly clear skies out there. 61 in Indianapolis, 58 in Shelbyville, 54 in Muncie. Running about 5 degrees cooler than we were at this time yesterday morning. We've also got that crisp in the air with that dry dew point in the 40s and 50s. And that's where we'll stay, I think, through the day today. Winds right now, they're at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Satellite and radar is quiet. Just a couple of clouds here and there. Regionally we're still pretty quiet. This is going to change though as we head throughout the night tonight and into this weekend. That UV index today is at a five. So as you're heading out to the bus stop, temperatures in the 40s, you might need a light jacket. 80 by this afternoon, plenty of sunshine. As we go through the evening hours, temperatures tonight will gradually drop back into the 60s. So if you're heading out to the Indians game, you might need just a light jacket out there. Future view will try and bring in a couple more clouds through the day today. I really expect a lot of sunshine. I do think clouds start to thicken up as we go through the overnight hours. We'll start off our day on Saturday with those mostly cloudy skies and then watch what happens. Rain chances start to move in as we head into the afternoon. I think everyone has a good chance at seeing rain at some point this weekend, whether that's Saturday or during the day on Sunday because we've got rain chances both days. Showers are more likely for everyone through the day on Sunday. What does that do to our temperatures? We'll have temperatures close to 80 tomorrow, then things start to cool down as we head into Sunday with those temperatures in the lower 70s. We keep the daily rain chances pretty much every day next week, but check out what Future View does. We do have a lot of dry time. Here's Monday night. Here's during the day on Tuesday. So you'll notice not everyone seeing rain every single day, but I do have those spotty shower chances as we head into Thursday and Friday of next week. In terms of rainfall totals, half an inch to an inch, not out of the realm of possibility. We do still need it. We are still seeing those abnormally dry conditions on the drought monitor, but I think the rain that we'll see over the next couple of days will really improve that. 80 today, mostly sunny and warm. Temperatures tonight dropping to about 60. We'll have those increasing clouds. It'll be a little bit cooler tomorrow. Still pretty warm. Temperatures close to 80 and those shower chances return tomorrow afternoon. As we go through the day on Sunday, those shower chances are more likely and then we'll see those daily rain chances again pretty much every day next week. Not seeing washout days, but it's probably a good idea to have that umbrella handy. Nick. All right. Good advice there. All right.